Hello? <laughs> this is part three, the final fucking part. Thank you so much. It's been an amazing three weeks and uh, there's been a lot of people involved. And I'm really excited to show you the rest of what we've done, what we've created. Wow! <laughs> Are you guys ready? Do you want to see my third and final outfit? You were here! You were here! Thank you so much for being here, each and every one of you! Uh, this outfit, honestly, every single outfit, I love them all so much, but this one I think is my favorite. And I think you'll see why when I get to show you, finally. So, uh, let's start how we always do it, shall we? <laughs> let's show some feet. <laughs> I have some pizzas. <laughs> and I have a little bit of steppies too. See? I got steppies. <laughs> Let's move on to the next fucking part. Well, you know, where there's feet, there's usually legs. And I have some of those. I also have knee pads what could those be for they're so you know useful for so many things now whenever i'm on my knees i have protection i could be on my knees all day now that's great <laughs> it's, it's great i could be like one of the, those uh uh you know in those video games those girlies you know what i mean the 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 shooter game what's it called nikkei i could be like a nikkei because I have these knee pads now. <laughs> or roller derby, yeah. I could join the roller derby, that'd be fine. <laughs> There's some straps and, um, ooh, some other really nifty details as well. Oh, more straps. And something familiar. <laughs> because this is my new outfit after all. <laughs> um, what do you guys think? I have some elements that you probably will recognize because I just got to keep them with me wherever I go. Yeah. <laughs> got to be strapped always. <laughs> strap on, strap on. Yeah. <laughs> Wait, not that kind of strap, the fuck? <laughs> I'm going to keep going. Oh my goodness. What is this? Is that a fucking skirt? Ain't no way. Ain't no way. Your boss? Your boss is wearing a skirt? Is this really me? That's crazy. That's crazy. <laughs> but it's cute, right? And also, yeah, I did get arrested in handcuffs, but you know what? Uh, we busted out of that shit. <laughs> but, um, I'm gonna need some help getting this thing off. I I'm gonna need some help, but for now, it's just gonna, uh, it's just gonna hang out here. Nice bracelet? Dude, anybody want to, uh, you know, be connected? We could be together forever. <laughs> Who wants to be on the other end? <laughs> together forever. Together forever. Okay, guys, I also, as you can see, have a pretty nifty leather jacket. And it's red! In typical Ellie fashion, of course. Um, and classic me, I accidentally ripped my stockings. I'm not very good at stockings. I don't know, man. I just thought they were kind of cute, you know? All right, moving on! What do you guys think? What do you think? Do you like my skirt? Do you like it? <laughs> you love it. Oh, I'm so happy. <gasps> Wait, is that tummy? That's familiar. I can actually take this little belt off too. So you can see belly button. No, no belly button. <laughs> All right. Do you guys like my pins? I have some pins. Do you recognize any? One of them says syndicate. That's you, that's us. And one of them is our little alien logo. <laughs> it's also my band logo for my band, the aliens. Okay, moving on. I'm gonna do this so you guys can see all the little details. 
Do you like my jackets? Moving on down. <gasps> ah, is that Booba? <laughs> it wouldn't be me without it. <laughs> let's be real. Let's be honest. <laughs> We're not going to focus here too long, though, because I don't want Twitch Daddy to get really angry at me. <laughs> but uh, it's pretty nifty, isn't it? Do you like my new top? Do you like it? Also, what's this? <laughs> what is this? Yeah, that's right. I got a big ass gun. Of course I do. <laughs> of course I do. <laughs> is that a Scar L? It's like based on a couple of different guns that I like, but it's actually a little bit of an original design. Um, but I just sent some references of guns that I like and Scar L was one of them. So yeah. <laughs> but uh, it's pretty cool. All right, do you want to see my fucking face? <laughs> well, you guys have seen my face before, but you haven't seen this because I got a new hairstyle. <laughs> what do you guys think? What do you guys think? Do you like the, uh, do you like the hair? Do you like the trip? <laughs> Not too bad, huh? <laughs> I hope you like it. Rockstar, fuck yeah. Dude, I'm ready, I'm ready. <laughs> shoot you, shoot you with love. <laughs> yeah, I got some sunnies. I hope you like those too. But that's not all. I have so many more things to share with you about this uh, design and um, new outfit and all the things that come along with it. So this is the full model with the full outfits. What do you guys think? And of course, I also have steppies. I haven't had steppies before, but when I look to the side over here, I can actually step to the side so I can have some good stompas. But you know what? That's not all that I can do. All right, that is not all because watch this. Watch this. Are you ready? <laughs> I can spread them. <laughs> Just like my other model, I can also uh, spread them. <laughs> I got to do my power pose. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> <laughs> yes, uh, pretty cool. I have some options with this uh, model with the rigging and everything that I can do. Um, speaking of options, I can be a little bit sassy. I'm feeling a little bit sassy right now. I don't know. I don't know, man. <laughs> Let's put this away for a second. See, I don't know where it goes. We're just going to pretend that, uh, you know, I have I have a secret pocket that that goes into. I'm just gonna shove that right up my ass. There you go. Um, let's see what else we can do. Hands on the hips for superior hip slay. Check this shit out, guys. <laughs> what do you think about that? It's so good for dancing. Bah. <laughs> Do you like it? Do you like it? <laughs> but uh, this is perfect because every time you guys piss me the fuck off, which is like on the daily when you call me short and when you make fun of how much I smell and when you make fun of how many L's that I take every single day. Hmm. I'm so mad. I'm so freaking pissed. I can't believe you would fucking see that. You're so rude for that. Hmm. <laughs> and if I really wanted to get sassy with it, well, <laughs> I could be very, very disappointed in you. <laughs> hmm. Um, so I can cross my arms, which is pretty fucking badass. And uh, another cool thing about this is that I can mix and match a couple things. Fuck you, chat. 
Fuck you. Fuck you guys. <laughs> but I can also do this as well. Uh, uh, <laughs> Pog? Pretty awesome, huh? What do you guys think? <laughs> all right, there's more to this outfit. Do you want to see? First of all, you've seen my gun on my shoulder. But I also have a duffel bag full of cash. <laughs> Stolen money. This is from the vault. Boys, we did it. Let's go, baby. Let's go. What do you think? Quite the haul that we've made. I mean, look at what's still back there. There's still so much left to steal. For your student loans? I got you, bagel. <laughs> um, all right, but there's also this. Check this shit out. What do you guys think? <laughs> it's payday time? I think we definitely need to play some payday for sure. L-E-E-N Fortnite weapon skin? Bro, this is our skin. If we had a weapon skin, this would be it. <laughs> What do you think? But that's not all that comes along with this outfit, because if we're going to be doing a heist, we're going to need, you know, potentially to wear a disguise. You know, we don't want to show our faces. So uh, I found this mask that I really, really like. Do you want to see? This is my new mask with my new outfits. I hope you like it. <laughs> what do you think? Do you like it? I think it goes really well with this outfit. Don't you? You like it? Okay, but I haven't even showed you like the coolest part of this mask. Here, let me get nice and uh, close to you. You wanna see something really cool? What do you think about that? <laughs> Not too shabby, huh? <laughs> Kitsune. Yeah, and also, of course, just like on my other outfits and my other model, it wouldn't be complete without... Without my ears and tail. <laughs> Four ears? I actually have six ears now. <laughs> I got so many ears. So many ears. I also have my OG mask. This is my original mask. I love this mask, so I ain't getting rid of it. <laughs> what do you think, guys? What do you think? That's pretty much everything that I could show for this new outfit and this model. There's other things I could do, like I could take my jacket off. Um, oh wait, I forgot, I have a vest as well! Check this shit out! I have a tactical vest because, you know, we're going in heavy. We're going in loud. We're going in loud and we're coming out heavy. Yeah, gotta, gotta wear protection, always. <laughs> Alrighty, that's not all though. Now that I've showed off my beautiful final outfits, my final outfit reveal, which honestly, I'll probably be rocking this one the most because this outfit is really fucking special to me. Um, and it really makes me feel like myself. Uh, the other thing about this outfit that's kind of cool is that I can have all of my original um, hairstyles and my new one too. I can have my new, you know, one that I got for the casino heist. I can have my regular long hair like this here. I'll show you better. I'll zoom out a bit. This is what it all looks like with all the different hairstyles. So like this, <laughs> um, I could do my bun hair. Bun hair. I can do, let's see, what else? Short hair, of course, the classic short hair. Bun hair, top tier, thank you so much. Short hair is the crowd favorite. Um, twin tails, ooh, this looks kinda cute with this outfit. I think all the hairstyles look really great with this outfit. What do you guys think? And of course, my ponytail, the classic Ellie ponytail. Yeah. 
Uh, what do you think, everybody? What do you What do you think of my new outfit? Do you like it? We're gonna do some thank yous. So let me uh, get over to the screen here. Alrighty. So I want to do some shout outs real quick. Wait, what the fuck? Oh, I forgot to turn the alerts up. <laughs> Goodbye, alerts. <laughs> Um, shout outs! First of all, this is Riki To, my amazing artist who has created all of my new outfits and models. Uh, me and Riki To have been cooking. We designed everything ourselves um, with, you know, looking at different references, things that we liked, elements of design that we liked. And neither of us are experts in design. So it was really hard, but we fucking did it. We put our brains together. We worked hard for months. We came up with some stellar designs, including this beautiful dress over here. See, this is all Rikito's art, and Rikito also did a lot of my panels for my lore video. Um, they did the first lore video and the teaser trailer as well. Look at this beautiful art. They are absolutely insane. I am so grateful to work with them. I've been working with Rikito for two years now. They did my first model, my 1.5, and my 2.0. Yeah, we've been working together for over two years. <laughs> So perfect, right? Look at this art. Isn't it stunning? <laughs> so big shout out to Rikito99. Please make sure to go show them love. Uh, you know, if you want to um, commission an amazing artist, consider Rikito. Follow them, support them. They deserve all the love in the world. I'm so lucky. I'm so lucky. Thank you so much, Rikito, for all your hard work. You've been cooking, you've been working, and it's all come uh, to this wonderful point. They also did this as well. These are my 2.0 designs, my OG outfit, my swimsuit, and my athletic outfit as well. So we've designed everything. <laughs> okay, next up we have the wonderful, the beautiful, the amazing Oi Kelly. Oi Kelly, Kelly Chan, you are incredible. Thank you so much for all your hard work. Um, Kelly is the person who has rigged my models. So she's a VTuber rigger. Thank you. Thank you so Hi, Rikito. Thank you. Thank you. Rikito and Kelly, these two cooking together? They're insane. They're absolutely insane. They are so, so talented. And I am just so grateful. And they're wonderful to work with as well. So please, if you're looking for somebody to rig something for you, consider Oi Kelly. Check this out. Like, look at this rigging. Isn't it just beautiful? It's so amazing. It's so amazing. I love. <laughs> I love it. And the hair and everything too. Absolutely insane. Well, there we go. Okay, so a big shout out and a big, big, big thank you to Oi Kelly. I have put Kelly through so much work, you guys. Even today, I had last minute stuff for Kelly to do. And you know what? She was like, I got this. We're gonna do this. We got this. Absolutely amazing, thank you so much. Sounds like Ellie, yep, it's me. All right, I'm gonna give you her Twitter. She's also on Twitch as well. Can I get a shout out for Oi Kelly Chen, please? Or Oi Kelly um, on Twitch, and you guys can follow her because she also streams. Rikito, I'm not sure if you ever are going to stream, but you know what? Why not just drop some follows anyway? I think they do stream sometimes and maybe do some art for you guys. Yeah, I think they stream and do art. So please make sure to go support Kelly and Rikito so you can watch them do art and rigging. Uh, Kelly often does rigging on stream um, and also does some other fun things like GTA RP. And yeah, you can check out Rikito's beautiful art skills. Next up! Part three of the lore video was made by Stain Senpai. And you might have seen this guy in the lore video. Uh, he has a bit of a cameo because he's actually part of the syndicate as well. Um, but he also has his own gang called Horny Gang. <laughs> and uh, I bet you can imagine some of the artwork that he might make. He has done some art for me, some spicy art, some beautiful art. He's an amazing artist. He also does like tattoo designs and like really cool like metal uh, font design, that kind of thing. <laughs> but yeah, no, Stain Senpai is absolutely 
cracked. He's a goaded artist. Stain, thank you very much for all your hard work. Um, actually, something about Stain that you guys don't know is that he and I came up with all the storyboards for all three lore video pieces so that when we asked Rikito and Mark to work on the other two parts, um, they knew exactly what to do because uh, uh, Stain had storyboarded everything out. He had a really great vision for this lore video. I told him what I wanted and together we put it all together and it, it turned out great. And we did three separate parts, three separate artists for three separate outfits and it all went together very cohesively. I will be up uploading the entire lore video onto my YouTube channel with all three parts in it. So yes, this is Stain Senpai. His uh, Twitter is in the chat. Please make sure you go show so much love to Stain, okay? Next up, we have Mark Draw 98 Oh my god, that's my butt. You know what? It's art. It's just a booty. It's just a butt. It's, you know what? We're gonna, we're gonna, look at this beautiful artwork. Look at this beautiful artwork. Mark is so goaded. He's another amazing artist um, who did part two of the lore video. So Rikito did part one, um, Mark did part two, and Stain did part three. Amazing artists to work with, by the way. They were all, they're all super like quick. They're great communication. Um, they love uh, listening to your, you know, ideas and feedback and, and, and they listen to you. They're really, really great. They have so much passion for what they do. So please make sure to go support um, all of these artists who are part of these projects, okay? So that is Mark Draw. Yes, 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 moving on, Omorphia. Omorphia is responsible for the backgrounds that I have. Um, all of my backgrounds, including the syndicate garage, my bedroom, um, the casino, and now the new vault scene as well. I've gone to Omorphia for every single one of my backgrounds, pretty much, and uh, they work so quickly. They're so, like, great communication as well. Um, you can do things very customized with them, like you can ask them for a lot of details and send them references and they'll do their best to include absolutely everything. So it's really fucking cool. Um, Amorphia is responsible for, is responsible for my backgrounds. Thank you so much, Amorphia. I want to share a couple other artists here. This is Clusiller. Here we go. I'm going to link them in the chat. Crucera is an amazing artist that I always go to. They've done some great work. They've done um, VTuber models, including uh, Onigiri's VTuber model. Um, they are super fucking cracked. And the reason why I wanted to share them is because um, I had actually commissioned them for some designs for my uh, outfit. Because like I said, me and Rikito, we were like, we're not like pro designers, but you know what? We are now, right, Rikito? I think you could call yourself a designer at this point because you're so good at it. Um, but at the time, we were both like, uh, uh, we don't really know what we're doing. So I was like, I'm going to see if I could commission some artists for some designs and stuff. Um, and we could go based off of that. So I commissioned uh, Kurusera to do a couple different designs. And originally we wanted to do like that you could remove the dress and then underneath would be the bunny suit. But it was a little complicated and I loved these designs so much. And I ended up taking elements from these designs and cooking them into our new thing. Like you could see the grenades in the dress. That was from Kurusera. Um, and absolutely amazing. Also the red color for the bunny suits. And there's so many elements of these designs that I love. Um, at the end of the day, me and Rikito just kind of like, we, we created something that really felt like me, something that really uh, resonated with me and that was very cohesive with everything and uh, kind of had the vibes that I was going for. But I wanted to share some of the inspiration, some of the uh, references that we were looking at when we were creating the final design. And I also wanted to just shout out Kurusera for their amazing work and show you guys Look at this design. If you're looking for somebody to design some uh, banging outfits, definitely consider them. Um, I think I already linked them. Yeah, there we go. Thank you for linking them in the chat. Next, we have Akagi. Akagi is a wonderful artist as well. And they, I commissioned them 
to help me with the design for my tactical outfit. So this was another uh, idea for the tactical Ellie outfit. Um, there are elements of this that I absolutely love, such as these like little robotic seahorses that carry a gun with like, it's, it's like a box full of guns and explosives. I love this idea so much and I might actually implement that in the future, in future outfits. Um, really loved the design that they created. As you can see, there are elements that we took, for example, uh, they had, they came up with the idea of these uh, dollar symbols, like different money symbols from different countries. Um, and we used them and incorporated them in this design. The straps, um, different elements like the chains, like the, uh, the uh, what do you call it, the handcuffs, the glasses. Like there's a lot of things that I really loved about this design, um, but it, I ended up tweaking it a little bit more to something that I kind of visualize and we ended up fi getting this final design, me and Rikito, that we really fell in love with and went with. But I wanted to share with you guys some alternate designs and what could have been because I don't want these to be unseen. They are so beautiful. They are amazing. Maybe in the future I'll have an outfit like this one. Um, but I just wanted to say a huge thank you to Akagi for your hard work. Um, and they're also working on some other designs for me right now. Yeah, like an alternative design, exactly. But I mean, I gotta slow down with the outfits, guys. I can't, I can't, I gotta give my artists and I gotta give everyone some breaks, you know what I'm saying? They've been working so fucking hard. They need a break from me, man. I, I have so many ideas and so many things I wanna do. Um, I, I gotta let them breathe and let them do their own thing for a while because holy shit. I am, I am a very demanding bitch. <laughs> these concept arts are amazing. Yeah, these are concept arts and I really wanted to share them. I didn't want them to go unseen. Uh, both Kurusera and also you can see that um, in the, in when we did the lore video part one, some of the color scheme from this was taken because we really loved the colors that were used. And um, of course you can see like the yellow straps and everything, uh, just amazing, fantastic. There's stripes on the chest. A lot of um, elements from these designs that I loved, but we ended up kind of tweaking them a little bit to create um, the finalized designs. And I love these concepts and maybe one day I'll be able to bring them to life as well. Oh, also the knee pads. I got the knee pads as well from this design. Just gorgeous, gorgeous design. I really want to use this, uh, this box. Oh, something cool about this box, you guys, is that it tracks the total amount of money that I've stolen which is really cool. And I actually uh, got Kay to incorporate that into my 3D VR chat worlds. We have that idea in the VR chat world. And I got that idea, or well, I don't know, Kay also had the idea too. But um, I wanted this idea because I, I was inspired by what they created. So cool, right? Thank you, Akagi. Thank you so much, Akagi and Kurusera. Okay, guys. One more, well, a couple more things. Uh, my band is called The Aliens. Look out for us. I'm going to be cleaning up our Spotify and having a lot more on there. Uh, Spotify has been a little tricky for uploading just because there are other bands that share the same name, but that's okay. Um, they're like in Australia or something. It's, it's one of those things where it's like, I don't know. I just have to establish my own band and my own brand on Spotify, but I do have everything uploaded on YouTube um, and all the background music that you listen to for this debut is actually by the aliens, except for um, the cover of Blue Sugar. But I mean, we did a punk rock cover of that and that's us playing it. But the the, the Blue Sugar song is by Ren Zoto originally. Yeah, check out my YouTube channel. YouTube is L-E-E-N. Check out my YouTube channel if you want to see lots of awesome videos that my editors uh, edit and create for me. Funny clips and compilations, gameplay, and also things like music and music videos. Yeah, okay. Moving on, I have an announcement, a couple of announcements. We've got some new merch. Myself and Uwu Markets have teamed up to update my Uwu Market merch shop. I have had the same merch in the shop for a while now. We have all brand new merch now, baby. Let me show, show you what we cooked. Let me show you what we cooked. Check this out. Check this shit out. We have the uh, dragon hoodie that is not going anywhere because this is a favorite of a lot of people. So we're going to keep this one. But check out the new designs. Look at this. Look what they cooked. What do you guys think? This is the backside of the hoodie. And uh, of course, there's what you can see on the arms. This is the front. Merch drop. Ellie Bullet Fire Hoodie. What do you guys think? Look at this fucking sleeves. 
They look so good, man. They look so good. I love the colors. I'm gonna be getting this one myself. And uh, you can get a couple different colors. I also requested specially to them. I was like, um, are we able to have other colors in the shop? And they were like, yeah, we can start to have some other colors. So I got um gray hoodie as well. And there's some t-shirts with the design on it. Let's see what else we got in here. We got a tank top. The other thing I really wanted to do for this merch uh, drop is you guys, if you know me, you know that fitness is really important to me. I wanted to get some uh, gym drip. I wanted to get some stuff that you guys could wear in the gym that I could wear in the gym. Uh, so we have a tank top. We have a pair of shorts. Pog. We have sweatpants. Look at these. Look at this design. I love this. I love this. How cute is that? So cute. Yeah, gym drip. And, but wait, there's more, there's more. You can also get the design with my bunny suit outfit on it. <laughs> look at this and look at the sleeves. Ellie gambling buddy ho bunny hoodie. This is the front. Why I always got my tongue out? <laughs> Why I always got my tongue out, huh? Wallacoon is crying. I'm sorry, Wallacoon. I'm sorry. Just know that every time you guys uh, get merchandise, it supports me directly. So I really do appreciate every each and every one of you. And uh, we got some different colors. We have a white hoodie now. So there's black, there's white, there's a t-shirt, and also a red t-shirt. I thought it would look really good on a red shirt. Oh my god, holy bazongas. Holy booba. Holy honkers. Holy honkers, Batman. That's... That's crazy. Um, and you can also get this on the tank top, the shorts, and the sweaties as well. Look at this, guys. Look at this. This is my new dress design on a large size mouse pad. Isn't it gorgeous? Isn't it beautiful? You want that? Isn't this? Oh my gosh. I honestly feel so lovely and beautiful in this artwork. I think it is stunning. Ubu Market and my family out at Ubu, you guys have outdone yourself for this merch drop. Thank you so much for working with me. And all the artists that are involved are absolutely insane. Uh, definitely support because you're supporting artists and you're supporting creators like myself. So merchandise uh, is a great way to support your favorite VTubers and streamers. You just bought a new mouse pad? Ah, and now you need this one too? Dude, one thing that you can do is if you um, are using one mouse pad, you can always cycle them out or you can get them framed. Like sometimes when I don't use a mouse pad, I just put it on my wall. I try to find like a, a picture frame that it would fit in um, and I just display them instead. Yeah. Um, they're a little bit heavy, but you can find frames that fit to them. Okay. Um, and that's all that I have in my store for now, but we do have some other things cooking. Wait, actually, I lied. There's a second page. <laughs> I'm so stupid. I thought they just weren't ready yet. <laughs> Dude, I'm dumb as shit. Oh my god. So we have some Bandit and Ace merch. We have stickers. We have a mug and we have a keychain. Look at these fucking cuties, guys. These are my little mascots. Uh, hopefully that'll be one of my next things that we work on in the stream, um, is getting these bad boys out here. Cause, uh, I think they need to come join me on stream. What do you guys think? Your mug collector radar just went off. Look at these cuties. They're counting the cash for me. This is Bandit and Ace. <laughs> um, how cute are these guys? How cute are they? Look at them little pesky little, little thieves my partners in crime and uh the designs for bandit and ace were made by uh tony penguin which actually i'm just gonna give them a quick shout out tony penguin yeah this is tony penguin and tony does chibi art if you guys ever want to commission them for chibi arts or for a um design for like mascots or something they designed them together with me and they're also part of the syndicate so definitely go support fellow syndicate members like, look how fucking cute this is, man. I'm putting this on my keychain. I want this so bad. I want this keychain on my gun. <gasps> That'd be so cute. I wonder if in the future I could have that added to my, to my gun. That'd be amazing. And the last thing is we now have a water bottle. Because like I said, Jim 
is really important to me. Workout stuff is really important to me. So we have a lot of gym fit and we also have a water bottle. I actually specially requested this merch. So if, if Uwe Market's gonna be getting water bottles, uh, I, I hope they do because I love water bottles. I collect them and um, this is something that I wanted. So I want to say a huge thank you to them for doing this for me and um, hopefully for other creators too. This artwork is by Click Draws, the goat, and uh, there's also a backside to it. Um, and this uh, logo design is designed by Sean Senpai. And um, this is my logo, my official VTuber logo. And uh, it's on the other side. So you can get this lovely workout water bottle. It's a little bit um, spicy, but you know what? You know what? <laughs> Whether you're rocking it at the gym or just have it on your desk for your for your gamer subs, use code Ellie for 10% off. Uh, either way, it's going to be perfect. <laughs> um, you can have it with your collection. You could have your like waifu cups. You could have your Ellie water bottle. You can have your Ellie mug. There's so many things you can have, guys. It's great. So that is my whole merch store now. There's two pages, actually. We have so much merch that there's two fucking pages. Thank you, Uwu Market. I'm going to give you guys the link to my merch store. Oh, Bagel's already on it. There it is. There it is. So please uh, consider buying some merch. It's really um, supportive and helpful to me. And uh, just know, also, these prices, I believe, are in Canadian, which is why it looks like you might be going, oh, that's so expensive. But I believe it's Canadian because I'm Canadian. So it, it'll be a little, it'll look less in American dollars. Um, but yeah, how do we know for sure she hasn't been an AI this whole time? <laughs> I guess you don't know, but uh, I don't, last I checked, I'm not an AI. Maybe it's because I have real life titties. <laughs> Maybe it's because I, oh, yeah, those are definitely real. Yeah, those are definitely real. Um, last announcement. Do y'all want to see? Y'all want to see my last one? This is something I think you guys uh, are going to really love. And this is something that I'm very, very grateful to have been able to do. They're available right now. And I just want to preface this by saying that the more people who purchase one of these, the more likely it is that we can do more in the future. So the way that these drops work is people need to show interest. So I'm I am imploring you, people of the syndicate, my friends, my homies. This is my first time doing a drop like this, and uh, I'm so, so honored to share with you. We have a bandit plushie <laughs> from Makeship. <laughs> Thank you to my friends over in Makeship. You guys did incredible. Thank you so much. Look at this. Look at this, baby. Look at it. I actually have these. Um, let me see. I, I have a picture of them. Let me I, I'll upload it into Discord. So you wait. No, I can't. I lied. I can't. I lied. I oops. I just spoiled something. I almost just spoiled something. All I can say is if you guys really like this, you know, I don't want it to be lonely. I don't want it to be lonely. So and look at he's got a little dollar sign on his back or like a, it's like a hundred dollar on his back and his little tail. Look at, look at from the side. Look how fucking cute he is. I can't, bro. I fucking can't. I fucking can't. He's so cute. He's so cute. I cannot. I cannot. Um, but yeah, all I can say about, about Bandit is he needs his partner. He's really sad without, without Ace. So sad. So sad. He needs his homie. He needs his bro. And uh, if you guys want maybe potentially something like that in the future, and maybe even to be joined by their boss, maybe one day I could have my own plushie as well. You could have an Ellie plushie too. But if we're going to be doing that, then I'm gonna need your help and I'm gonna need your support because we need, we basically need these to be successful. And uh, the more people that buy these plushies, the more likely it is that I can do another um, plushie drop. So please consider. Also, it directly supports me as well. So I just want to say a huge thank you. Huge, huge thank you. Another one to your collection. I finally have my own plushie. Finally. Turn Ellie into a TV. Yeah, my dream, guys, is ideally I would like to have a bandit plush, an ace plush, and a plushie of myself. 
And then one day, maybe have those big squishy ones where it's like they, they're like laying on their tummy. I think that'd be so cute too, but that's like a future thing. But uh, I love Bandit and Ace so much. They're my, they're my little, my little cuties. He will join your growing plushy army and they will take over the world. Do you guys need some little uh, mischievous little thieves in your arsenal? <laughs> When's Ellie Chibi? Um, I don't know. I don't know. You just ordered Bandit? Thank you. Thank you so much, everyone. Um, they're honestly super affordable as well. Like really makeshift. Thank you so much. Um, they're available for a limited time. There's only 21 days or 22 days. Guys, I implore you. You want to pick one of these up before they're gone, okay? It's like 30 bucks USD. Or something like that. Um, anyways, that was my final announcement that I wanted to share. So we have a uh, new merch in the store from Ooh Market. We have a bandit plushie from Makeshift. Um, big shout outs to all the amazing artists and riggers who were involved in the making of my new outfit designs and my new model stuff. Thank you all so much. All the lore videos, the music videos, everything like that. Thank you so much. Alrighty. Hold on. Um, ba -ba -ba -ba, ba -ba -ba -ba, ba 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 There we go. There we go. Dude, that's pretty much everything that I had to show you. We did it. We did it. We did all three new outfits, bro. We did all three new outfits. We did my dress. We did my bunny suit. And we have tactical Ellie now. Thank you so much. You're so proud. Thank you so much. Thank you. Thank you to everybody who was involved. Thank you to all my friends for cheering me on. My mods for all your work and for supporting me. My amazing syndicuties, my syndicate members. Thank you very, very much, guys. Thank you um, for, for everything. I really do appreciate all the love and all the fucking support. Everything you guys have done for me from the bottom of my heart. I am eternally grateful. So thank you.